Coach, along the same lines about the offense, just uh, <clears throat> we haven't had a chance really to talk to you since the bowl game. Just what has the past four weeks been like within this facility? Probably some uneasy discussion about how that playoff game unfolded and just uh, direction going forward. Sounds like the guys are back working at it. And has that given everybody a clear vision of what's right and what's wrong? Yeah, uh, I, I put the the season was unfortunately in like that because that's not – I believe we were a year ahead of schedule. I believe we were. I did not envision that at the beginning of the season. I thought it was going to be a, a knockdown drag out. And then we started off really hot going to Norman, Oklahoma, and guys were starting to grow up. But we uh, did not play well, obviously. That's an understatement in the final game. Uh, believe it or not, and that's for me, that left, left this facility rather quickly. We went out, dove into recruiting, finished off one of the best classes in, in history. And the team's at it and going at it, and uh, with the intent that will never happen again. Uh, we also understand it's college football, and you're dealing with young people, and so uh, there's going to be some changes that are made uh, throughout, including just minor changes. Where we, you know, I just I think it's time to refresh a little bit the program, and uh, from minor things about where we do stretch, where we practice, you know, switch the fields, switch lockers, doing all kinds, just changing up some, some things. I'm going to change the coaches' offices all around. It just kind of, um, I can't remember the law. There's a business uh, where you change, change equates to 15% uh, percent increase in production. And so that's my, the whole thing we're going to do this year. Just kind of change things up a little bit.